Hello and welcome. On this video, we are going to be continuing our updates on the Gatsby Starter theme. And in this video, we are going to be updating the blog page. So if you remember last video, I believe we updated for the um, previous episodes, we updated the about page and all of that content. And we have our work page updated. Uh, we have the carousel working. And now I want to update the blog page. Um, so uh, what do we want to do on this blog page? So right now on the blog page, we have, if you look up here on the uh, URL, you'll see that, oh, let me center that. Um, let me zoom in here, sorry about that. Um, so, so you'll see on the URL on the blog page, you'll see all of our blog posts and all those blog posts correspond to our markdown files that we set up in the previous videos. So we have blog and websites. So there's four, no, there's three. Oops. And I believe four. Yeah. So there are four. So on the blog, we should only see three, but we're seeing all seven. Um, six actually, um, but we we only want the blog. So you'll see that this is website three, two, and then new beginnings is actually blog. And second post, yeah. So those are the actual blog. So what we want to do is we just want to display those, just the blog on this page. I don't care about websites or any uh, of my other work. That's what the work page is for. So what? Uh, we need to do is somehow we need to let the blog page know to only get blog posts and how do we do that similar to the work page the reference back the websites so these are my websites these are just fillers but we did that using the front matter on our markdown files so we need to do that with our blog posts so we have hello world if you click on the index, you'll see there is no uh, category. And I just, I'm going to use category blog just as like a reference. So we can use GraphQL to grab the blog files. So I'm going to copy that line, exit out, go to the next one, copy that, close, and do it to all the blog, blog posts. So that's three. That should be it. Now, if we go back, uh, yeah, I think I have to restart my, no, I'm sorry. We have to, now that we added that, we have to tell GraphQL, right? We need to update the GraphQL uh, query. So it only gets the blog category posts. Um, uh, so how do we do that previously? We did, it has to be in here. And so in sort, we want to add a, a filter. Hopefully that will auto update. So we're just going to do this, do front matter, and then do category, and then EQ log, because that's what I just put in there. And there you have it. You don't even have to restart the server. You have three posts in here now. These are all blog posts. Easy enough, right? Okay. Um, you also, you might notice the URL changes to forward slash new beginnings, the name of the post. What I want to do, and, and websites as well, I want to do blog forward slash new beginnings. And I'll, I'm going to set that up in the next video, but not this video. So right now we're just doing like the blog page and we're getting the posts on there. And now I'm going to uh, style it. Oh, let me see. Um, that's updated. Front matter is updated. Yeah, I want to do a little styling here. I don't need my bio. I, I'm going to make the blog as basic as, as I can or as... Um, yeah, I don't, I don't need my bio on three different pages. 
but I'm going to remove it and then you can see how I remove it. And if you want to keep it, you can keep it. So we're going here. So we're doing an import bio from components bio, right? So if we just do a find of bio and you can find it there and you can just remove it, save. And now it's gone. Um, we don't need this any longer. I'll save that. And for the SEO, I'm gonna, going to say blog page. Or I can say Chris Shimin's blog. There you go. Okay. Um, uh, what is this? I don't, I don't want this little summary. I don't think I need it. I just want the, the title and the date. So I'm going to get rid of this section. Don't believe, I believe this is the section. And yes, there it is. So we just have the, the title and the date of the post. And remember those, the date of those posts are actually from our markdown file which you can set in here and th that is the default and you can change it you don't need the time you don't need any of that save it and nothing changes and the order of the blog posts are by date obviously uh they're descending and you can change it to ascending if you'd like. Uh, maybe at a later date, I'll add like a favorite and somehow uh, save your favorites to the top or I'll add a sidebar where you can see the categories. But for right now, it's just going to be blog posts and just a list of all of them. And I am going to... So I, I'm using a styled component. I'm just going to copy and paste this in and hopefully nothing breaks. So uh, I will need to actually update the title or like the name of my styled component. So header, it'll be here. So I'll just call it, whoops, header. There you go. Um, what changed? I'm not sure actually. Something should have changed. Site title. Um, sorry. I want to remove my name. Uh, that's the site title of the post. So do that, do a full find, and you'll see right here um, a prop is coming in for site title. I'm just going, going to delete that. And I don't need that now since I'm no longer, no longer using it. Um, okay, so since it's a style component, it's on the render, so I think I need to restart my server? Yeah, because that title should not be there, and that's how I know that I need to do that. So I'm going to restart it right now. I forgot, we need to add a styled, because I'm using style components, but I just don't have it imported yet. So. I need to do import, if I can type, styled from styled component. The save. There we are. There we go. Okay. So that's the style I have, very basic. And the idea, just a list. You click on that and it takes you to the page. And then the footer you have, you can go back and forth. So in my next video, I'm gonna um, fix this issue. So you can see that even though I'm on the blog page, there should only be three posts. And you click back and forth, or like you click forward and back. I'm going actually now to website two. So that's like, that is my, my work 
my work posts. So I do not want that. So I'm going to fix that in the next video. Uh, hopefully um, you like my simple design for the blog. Feel free to edit it as you will. But uh, yeah, I think that's that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and until next time.